Good morning, cats. I'm Crosby Albright. And I'm Jayla. Let's get into it with your Cats Eye News. On Saturday, March 16th, there will be, from 12 to 7 p.m., Congressman Carson will host his annual Youth Opportunities Fair. It will be held at the Central Library in downtown Indianapolis. The event will connect young people and their families with 75 employers and community organizations offering jobs, internships, and programming opportunities. Working youth ages 14 and up will also have their chance to practice their interviewing skills and gain valuable insight on how to approach potential employers. Youth that is not able to work and their families can learn about local camps and other engagement programs offered during the summer and year-round. Lawrence North has Jobs for America's Graduates, a.k.a. the JAG program. Employee Indy is coordinating with these groups for in-school field trip attendance at the event. If you need transportation, Ellen is able to provide to provide transportation and would like to bring an additional group of students during or after school. Please reach out so we can make the most of your visit. Next up, with swimming, four of boy swimmers are going to state. After winning six out of 12 events while also setting records for the 200 medley and 200 freestyle relays, the boys will represent us at IUPUI and Auditorium and begin at 6 p.m. Congrats and good luck to Joe Grease, Jasper Suter, Bennett Vale, and Tyler Berkla. The second prep event of 2020 will be held on March 25th at 6 p.m. in the Professional Development Room at LECC, titled How to Talk to Your Child About Drugs, and a follow-up to the January event on what parents need to know about drugs. The event will feature a brief presentation by District Prevention Coordinator Mark, Mark Pardue, Pardue. <laughs> and will then include roundtable conversation with parents who can engage with both him and other attendees. If you can't attend in person, there will be a Facebook live stream so you don't miss a thing. Child care and Spanish translation will also be provided if needed. There is a pep rally today at 10 a.m. in the gym to celebrate and wish luck to both swimmers and basketball players who are sectional champions and set new school records. Good luck at state this weekend. And now on to weather and commercial break with Aaliyah. Good luck, Ellen swim team. Hope you enjoy success at state. Good luck, swimmers. 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 Hello cats, I'm Ali and with your weather day. Let's get into it. Alright, so today's weather is gonna be periods and rain. It's gonna be 23. The highest 31, the lowest 17. Alright, in the more time it's gonna be 52. After school is gonna be 29. And alright, coming into this week, it's gonna be it's gonna get a little bit warmer, but it's gonna have rain. All right, so yesterday's question was, whatever we believe about ourselves and our ability comes true for us. The answer was Susan L. Taylor. All right, today's question is, who created the first black women hair products? Madam C.J. Walker, Harriet Tubman, Oprah Winfrey, or Gail King? And all right, cats, I'm my leading with your weather, and let's get back to the anchors. And I'm here with uh, Jonah. Jonah, and he is one of the cast members in The Great Gatsby this Saturday. Come support. Yeah, Friday and Saturday. Uh, Friday I'm going to be Gatsby in our Friday night show. Uh, we've got two different casts on Friday and Saturday, so come see both. Yep. Go. So, cast, I'm here with Eduardo. 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 You got it, bro. Yep. And um, he is another I cast. In the Great Gatsby, and what are you? What's your role? I am playing the man himself, Jay Gatsby. Jay Gatsby, here it is, the star. Friday and Saturday, seven o'clock. Yep. Well, uh, wh which one would you be in? I will be in Saturday's cast. My other cast member, Jonah Herman, will be in Friday's cast. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Yep. So, cats, I'm here with. Olivia Atkinson. Olivia Atkinson, and she is also a cast member in The Great Gatsby. The Great Gatsby. And what is your role? Um, I play Daisy with the Saturday cast. Daisy with the Saturday cast. So come out Saturday and see Olivia. Cast, I'm here with Maya Casanova. Yep, Maya Casanova. And she is a cast member in The Great Gatsby. Yep, and what is your role? I am one of the Jordans in The Great Gatsby. We have two casts. Mm-hmm. And would you be performing on 
Friday or Saturday? I am a part of the Saturday cast. Oh, so come see my. What's up, cats? I'm Jeremy. This is Alec. And I'm Seth. And you're watching Disney Channel. Oh, no, you're watching oh. Cat's Eye. Seth, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> this is Cat's Eye. But Seth is a part of The Great Gatsby. Yep. And what do you play? What is your role? Um, I'm Nick Carraway. Nick Carraway. That's cool. That's good. And would you be performing in uh, Saturday or Friday play? I'm Saturday. Saturday. So come out and see Seth. I'm here with I'm Cameron. Cameron, and he is a cast member of, of the Great Gatsby. Yeah, the Great Gatsby. Yep. Yeah. And what is your role? Um, so I play Nick Carraway in the Friday performance, and then the Saturday performance we have a different cast, and I play George Wilson. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And when is the play? It's on Friday and Saturday. As okay. per my what previous sentence. Yeah, yeah. What, what's the time? What time is it? Time? It'll be at seven o'clock both nights. Both nights. Be there. All right. Thank you. So we're here with Gia, Sam. Yep, and they are cast members in the Great Gatsby. The Great <laughs> Gatsby, and what is your role? Gia? Uh, I play Daisy Buchanan on Friday night. On Friday night, uh, and and I play Jordan Baker on Friday night. Friday night. So come Friday night and see Gia and Sam, Sam <laughs> otherwise known as Daisy and Jordan. Yeah. Seven p.m. <laughs> Seven p.m. Go cut. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome back. <laughs> there will be a college fair here at Ellen in the gym on March 10th. Sign up for the Strive Scan at www.strivefair.com. Signing up will ensure you that colleges will already have your information for an easier and more efficient experience. When you register, make sure to take your barcode for the colleges to scan and make sure you attend because there is still time to apply for college. In more with college, 21st Century Scholars offers a great opportunity. Freshmen can create a graduation plan because you need it as soon as you can get. Sophomores can get workplace experience. Juniors can visit a campus. And lastly, the fantastic seniors can submit college applications, follow your FAFSA, and watch College Success 101. Make sure to take advantage of this. The Biomedical Science Program holds regular after-school seminars with guest speakers from the profession. The lead advisor from the IU School of Medicine at West Lafayette is coming March 11th at 4.15 to 5 to McKenzie LG I Room. They want to extend an invitation to any LN or LC student interested in medicine. The advisor and a couple current medical students will speak to what it takes to gain admission to graduate from medical school. They do shuttle buses to get students to McKinsey Center LC pickup will immediately begin after school at the Student Life Center door and for Ellen pickup is at 4 and the main entrance. However, students must have a ride to pick them back up from McKinsey after the event because they do not have a shuttle back. Our boys had a great week beating Pike 76 to 48, Fort Wayne South 88 to 53, and Howe 74 to 25. With the Pike win, the Wildcats are now the Mick Conference champions. The Wildcats will again face off against the LC Bears, this time in the opening round of sectionals. Two of the best teams in the state of Indiana will play in the first round of the tournament. The sectional is being hosted this year at LC. The Allen LC game will be played on Wednesday at approximately 8 p.m. Immediately after the first game between the Addicts and Cathedral at 6 p.m., if you don't have a ticket, you're out of luck. We are officially sold out. Sorry about it. Our girls are Marion County champions, Mick Conference, cha Mick Conference champions, sectional champions, regional champions, and semi-state champions. All goals at the beginning of their season are checked off. All but one. The IHSAA state championship will feature our Lawrence North Wildcats versus Northwestern at Baker Life Fieldhouse this Saturday at 8.15 p.m. Good luck, ladies. The cheerleaders are excited about the trips. Our basketball teams are on right now and will be ready to support our girls at Bankers Life Fieldhouse this Saturday and our boys basketball next week against LC in the sectional. They have been a valuable part of bringing the excitement to the crowd all season. Good job, cheerleaders. The wrestling team sent five guys to the IHSAA semi-state at Newcastle. Lo Logan Carinder, Anthony Hughes, Jeremiah Henderson, Ethan Butterfield, and Excel Brooks. Anthony Hughes qualified for the IHSAA state meet at 120 pounds and, comp and competed at Bankers Life Fieldhouse on Friday night. Unfortunately, he ended his season with a loss. Attention Unified Track. The parent meeting will be next Wednesday, March 4th at 4 p.m. and Wednesday, March 13th at 5.30 p.m. And lastly, the team meeting slash first practice will take place Monday, March 16th from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. and pickup is at door 7. 
Aftermath is available for English on Tuesdays from 4 to 5. Math tutoring is available on Wednesdays from and Thursdays from 4 to 5. And most cool opportunities, don't miss your chance to get some quick entertainment by attending the Great Gatsby Play on today and Saturday, 7 p.m. on both nights in the Ellen Auditorium. Tickets are $10 but are free for staff and children under 5, so make sure you come out and support our great theater program. And more with great shows, Mr. Ellen is coming to town for another year. March 20th at 7 p.m., come see our amazing male contestants put on an amazing show. Our contestants this year are pretty awesome because one of them is me. For our juniors, <laughs> Ennis Hayden, Nick Lockery, me, Brody Smith, Alex Welsh, and Sean Radford. And for our fantastic seniors, Jeremy Lee, Rashad Harris, Ethan Waters, Eduardo Alvarez, and Jasper Suter. Good luck, guys. That's all I have for today's amazing episode. Have a fantastic day, and, and go, go Cats! Go Cats! I'm Jeremy, this is Makah, and we want to know if you guys got, think you got a dance that can really go viral, but you, you know, kind of scared to, you know, put it put it out there. We want to help you guys put it out there. Hey, now watch this. If you got a dance that you think can go viral, show us. literally falling apart and the only reason we're even doing this kit is because Jeremy wanted to show off his awful dance moves so that's the tea